Jeff, this thing looks new. It is. So I got uh, five hours on it. All right. So this is our uh, 24 foot Centurion Enzo. And what have you done to it? Because I bet you you haven't left it stock. No, but I'll show you here in a minute. Let me get this bar up and I can uh, get this uh, stuff out. So Jeff, tell me how long have you been doing this for? This wake surfing thing? You know, Inland Surfer's been around for uh, 10 years now. Uh, we started uh, because we really like to surf and uh, we didn't have a way to get to the coast so we surfed here a lot behind boats so uh, we decided that we were going to make a board specially for surfing and uh, it has a completely different rocker and edge configuration than a normal surfboard would that you'd surf the ocean. So a lot less drag. Yeah, a lot less drag, really fast, scoots right along and then once we learned how to uh, weight the boats properly, um, here we are and uh, it compresses the wave on one side, we don't uh, get any white water yep. and we can get a good uh, 15 to 20 feet back of the boat. So this is a new Centurion Enzo 240 Plus. So you've been with Centurion a while, obviously. You've... Yeah, we've uh, partnered with Centurion because they were one of the first uh, folks to actually come up with a, a, to market wake surfing. Yep. And that's why we uh, still partner to them this day. Okay, so here's a trick question. Do Centurion have the best wake for wake surfing? I would say Centurion probably has the best wake for wake surfing because of its deep V hole okay. and configuration of how the bottom of the boat is. You got a lot of boats out there that kind of have a, a semi V or kind of a flat bottom. Those boats won't put up a wave like a Centurion will. Okay. And it's just a well known fact in the industry. You mentioned about weighting the boat. Can you just quickly show me? the sort of thing obviously with the boat's leaning over a lot right now that's the main part it's of because of you guys man you're big what, what are you guys saying? pushing 220 <laughs> 250 actually but oh, we won't go down that dang road dog. <laughs> that's why we love the red woody <laughs> um centurion obviously come through with factory ballast but the aim of the game is to get this boat to roll over on the surf you're siding as right. much as you can is that right right is there a limit to how far you want to roll it um not really uh we roll it right to the rub ale Okay. And uh, that's about the safest part, you know. When we when we're out there, we do come to a stop when we uh, the rider falls, so yep. we don't uh, you know swamp the boat in the yep. back end and stuff like that. But yeah, um, basically we just have a quick fill in the Centurion boat here, which is an actual um, gate that opens, fills this big tank, and then we put in some uh, custom uh, sacks ourselves that fill directly with a ballast puppy yep. that adds the extra weight, and we're basically good to go. Excellent. Well let's go hit it and have some fun. I can't wait to surf with big man Jeff. Yeah whatever. <laughs> what do you weigh in? <laughs> yeah what do I weigh? I weigh a buck sixty. There you go.